After promoting a 2016 or 2019 Windows Server to be a domain controller, you can no longer open up the network adapter properties in the usual way. So if I go to right click on open network and internet settings, for instance, or you can just go to the start button and settings. And from there, I click on change adapter options. Then we get this error. Now, this doesn't happen in a non-domain controller. So I'll show you how to fix this. One quick way without having to go through group policy and all that kind of stuff is just to go down to where it says network and sharing center and then click on change adapter settings and then you can change them here simply by right clicking and going to properties. So that's a quick way to do it. The longer way of doing it so you can go back and click on change adapter options in the future is a little bit different. I'm going to go down to the start button and choose run and type in GP edit dot msc for group policy editing and now we see the group policy editor but this is actually for the local computer not for the active directory domain so next thing we're going to do is under computer configuration we're going to go to windows settings and then we're going to go to security settings then we're going to go to local policies. Then we'll go to security options. And under enable user account control admin approval, I'll simply just type the letter U. It'll take me down to that area. I'm going to double click on it. And this is the user account admin approval for the built in administrator. We'll choose enable. Apply, OK, close, and now we need to restart the domain controller. I'm back in the server. I'm going to do the exact same thing I did last time and click on Change Adapter Options, and now it opens up just fine. So that is how you fix the Change Adapter Options on a domain controller in Windows Server 2016 and 2019.